Educational scientific research in the Arab world and the educational reality between the gap and the acrimony. Prepared by Dr. Asma Abdul Salam Abdul Qadir, Assistant Professor in Foundations of Education, Faculty of Arts, University of Dammam, Kingdom of Saudi Arabia. This study comes at a time in which efforts are being made to introduce policies for educational reform and develop scientific research in the Arab world. The study has discussed the educational research and activating its application in the field of education from an analytical perspective. The study proposes a systematic and a practical vision to make educational research beneficial in the field of education through submitting a proposal to take advantage of educational research in the Arab world. There are three objectives of the study. Firstly, to shed light on the subject of educational research and how to apply it in the educational field. Secondly, to explore the obstacles of applying the educational research results. And finally, to develop a proposal of how the educational research can solve the problems of the educational reality. The study methodology. Due to the nature of the study and investigating its aims, the descriptive analytical method was used. Theoretical background surrounding the study. Numerous studies have explored the relation between educational research and the educational field. Al Utaybi 2012 discussed the concept of scientific research and its relation with education. He highlighted the obstacles faced by the educational process and its influence on scientific research. Harub 2013 has proposed a method for applying knowledge to educational research to improve the quality of educational research which enhances the educational process and overcomes some educational problems. Anderson in 2007 introduced previous educational research results which can be applied effectively to improve methods of teaching academic courses. The study clarified possible strategies of capitalizing educational resources. Reagan 2012 discussed designing and developing professional career development programs based on educational research results in Pennsylvania. It highlighted methods of applying research outcomes in different professional career development courses. The educational research and educational process. There are several concepts describing the relationship between the educational research and the educational process components, including Clark in 2005, who defines the educational research as the scientific discovery which leads us to identify the causes of effective teaching and therefore developing the educational process. The following figure shows the relationship between the scientific research and the development of the educational process. The foundations of scientific research and educational institutions are four. Firstly, examining the information. Two, development of knowledge. Three, data and information collection for data and information analysis. All these four combined leads to developing the educational process through these foundations, which as a result produces the scientific research serving the development issues. The proposed vision are divided into three. Firstly, review of educational research policy. Secondly, develop a vision methodology. And finally, the provision of an enabling environment by capitalizing techniques and technology, development of research, and professional development. Based on the previous figure, these mechanisms can be achieved through the following actions. We can review the educational policies by drawing a research map to encourage applying effective methodologies to conduct multidisciplinary research. 
The research will be conducted nationally by a team of researchers to address the current problem. We can also review the educational policy by the development of agreements and protocols of cooperation and partnership between educational and research institutions. By capitalizing the use of technology and techniques through a common database of all colleges of education and educational research centers in the Arab world, including all, the f all of the following data. Real problems facing the educational field in the Arab world, the research projects that have been implemented annually, and the data from educational scientific institutions in the Arab world that promote educational research. Development of research through multidisciplinary research of optimal solutions for educational problems. Facilitating educational research conferences to influence trends for future policy and the preparation of records, reports and publications to publicize the efforts of institutions and presenting them to educational policy makers. Method, the methodological vision to optimize the application for educational research in the educational field. There are some proposals that could be useful in implementing educational research including critical methodology. The researcher must be familiar with the educational, social and human sciences underpinned by critical thinking. The researcher must also be equipped with the analytical skills and methods of implementation which form the basis of applying social and educational research. These skills are summarized in the following. Direct interaction with the object of research to achieve accurate and authentic findings. Continuous review of evolving theories. Sensitivity and respect of the human and cultural diversity which will ensure a culturally relevant research and study. Recommendations of the study. There are five main recommendations of the study. Firstly, the educational process is dynamic in nature, so you must keep pace with the dynamic educational research. Secondly, major steps have to be taken to make the scientific research practical. Thirdly, Greater importance must be given to future studies to conduct educational research in the Arab world. Fourthly, establishing academic centers for educational research which are financially and morally supported by governments and the private sector is essential. And finally, our final recommendation of the study is to create a link between schools and universities, between theory and practice by conducting research. Thank you for your time.